Bro, if you need an extra battery on this, touch grass. Ooh. What's touch grass? Is that, <laughs> is that an insult? <laughs> this is nice. I guess. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs>What is up, everybody? Welcome to today's episode of Dope or Nope. We're back with the third of three. Three of three. Three of three. It's called the best trilogy of all. Dope or Nope PlayStation 5 accessories. You guys have loved the first two. YouTube didn't like the second one as much because of the thumbnail. What was wrong with the thumbnail? Uh, it was the hookah accessory. Remember that? <laughs> so YouTube sniped that video down. So we're going to look at 10 things that are compatible with your PS5 that we think would make dope accessories to it. First product. Wait, are those metal? Hold on, go back down. The little controller top things, gold metal thumbstick. Metal. Grab me a black PS5 controller. Okay. And then the gold metal parts. We'll build an elegant luxury PS5 controller. Add a cart. We're about to make the dankest PS5 controller ever, bro. It's gonna be so litimous. All right, Woods, you're up. Short stuff. All right, let's take a look at that first product. Wow, no way, Jim. Shockers. That's right, Jan. I know what these are, <laughs> but you need to look at what these are. Yeah, so professional repair kit for better gaming. It's not as boring as it sounds. It sounds it pretty legit pretty boring. boring. No, check it out, open. Guys, look at our table. Bro, this is so clean. <laughs> See, that's what I do is I keep things super dirty so that when something's moderately clean, everyone's like, whoa. Wow, good job. Oh, wait, we're gonna have to really replace all the buttons on our PS5 controller. Bro, these are ugly. I don't want this. Well, here's what we're gonna do. Well, hold on, it could be really nice up in there. You don't know. Because it's going on the all black PS5 controller we got as well. Wow. <laughs> Why don't I do this? Mm -hmm. You wanna put on the white the one white because you wanna keep the black control all black, but that's not what we promised the audience, <laughs> Matt. They wanna but see They would the understand that this is ugly. You gotta see the vision, Matt. Look. The so oh, should... that's nice, dude. Yeah. I need an, an actual knife. Do I have a knife? You want flatheads, like small flatheads? Why would he want a flathead if he already has one? <laughs> <laughs> There's no high like, cool way to like embrace each other that way, you know? <laughs> I love you! You know, society didn't give us the tools to express love for each other, bro. Yeah, my dad so, never taught me how to use tools either, so. <laughs> bro, this is way complicated. That's what I'm saying. I might just have to do this and bring it back. Cut to the finished product. Guys, it's here. The controller is here. And by that, I mean I had to build it and I will never do it again. Was it that much work? It was, dude, I literally had to follow a 35 minute video. There's no dead space in this video. It's not like, hey, here's an ad. Oh, here's the problem with it. It sucks. There's a moment where if I pushed slightly too hard, on the back here, this joystick wouldn't work. This stick is still a little shorter than the left stick. For sure it is. How'd it get shorter? I don't know, dude. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. I think it looks pretty sick. It's orange. I like that. I also like that it has bullets for the buttons, like the back of bullets. You didn't change the triggers while you were there? I didn't have the triggers. I don't think we even oh, got triggers. Oh, yeah, that's right here. No way. Oh, they, they click too. I did a good job. It, this feels nice and cool to touch. Thank you. Proud of you, dude. Yeah, dude, I legit almost ripped my hair. I felt bad because Rue was getting the back, like the backlash of me being frustrated. Pulls up and he's like, looks at me like this. Just and I'm like, Rue, stop looking at me. And he's probably telling me, like, <laughs> I gotta go to the bathroom. And I'm like, I can't think, I don't know, I'm still looking up when I'm me. Like, but I was really frustrated. <laughs> I'm trying to do role playing, but I keep forgetting to switch. Well, thanks, man. I appreciate this. There's a solid chance the microphone in it might not work well. <laughs> but it looks like you did a great job, dog. Dude, that really means a lot because I put a lot of effort into that. <laughs> would you want to keep it? If you don't want to keep it. I mean, I would like to keep it. But keep I'm it. also you like. put all the work into it. I don't know if I'm really like, <laughs> this is self inflicting because knowing if I'm keeping it, it's going to stop working. So, uh, dope. I think. Look at these carpet covers. That's just the normal gamepad. Yeah, I was just making a, making a joke, but are you sure? <laughs> this is so you guys can text each other while you play online, right? No, you're absolutely correct. So you pretty much can like just, you know, slide into anybody's DMs while you're just mobbing through a game. Well, we're gonna test it. We're gonna test it. Thanks, Woods. What is this? Why did Tanner give it to me? Okay, I like this. This is okay. I'll, I'd probably actually use this, bro. Oh, you have to charge it separately? Oh, Ew. Yeah. Ooh. Good for business meetings, perhaps? Honestly, don't like it because your fingers are hitting this. Let's say like I normally would, which is my fingers are like down here like this. You're getting a grip on it. I'm getting a grip on the controller. Yeah. It's more comfortable. But when I when I throw this guy on here, there's no way. I, I just don't have enough room. And I have to charge this thing separately. Bruh, I'll just like speak into the mic. Well, how does it work? 
you go boop, boop, beep, boop. Right, right, right. I was gonna actually be <laughs> right, curious right, and see right. if- I was gonna see if it'd be faster to type a sentence with this or with this, but you brought up a great point where none of those matter. You just talk. You literally just press the talk button and you say the sentence and it types it out. And that's way fastest. Uh, way fastest. That made it almost, I don't know why. <laughs> my other problem with this. When I game, I get intense. So I play games that make my teeth grind. Um, <laughs> I, wait, 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 what? I tend to grip the controller hard and go, Arr! Like, Should have got you a rag to bite. A in. stick, bro. I die for the third time in a row. Ah! Pops off. I'm screaming, howling. Actually, are you? At, do you actually get mad at video games? Well, you're, it's intense. You're dodging. You're attacking. Yeah, you're yeah, attack. yeah. Yeah, that, that, that. Not out of anger, like ah! not like rage quitting. No, I'm never like. Rah, 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 <laughs> you know. <laughs> Some people do, bro. That's why I stopped. Really? I, I would have fits. But this was like back in junior high when yeah. hormones were just. <laughs> I go like the same thing, like <laughs> nope. Yeah, it's a nope. Just speak. Next product. What are these fur rings for? <laughs> what? Oh, control freak. They're for precision. Yeah, but I, I'm curious why. Is it so you don't have too much? Yeah, exactly. It's so you're, you're not, yeah. This is a dope commercial for a stupid ring. Why don't you just buy some peach rings? Bro? That's <laughs> Like, get some lifesaver gummies and go off, bro. Like, you don't need this. Can you imagine? You're right, though. That's a lot of work they put into a commercial for some foam. Just for some thumb ring. You know the profit margin on this is insane. Let's add it to cart. Oh! I was more excited about these than any other product we bought. Okay, so these are the precision rings. Soft, medium, and hard. Oh, they come with all three. When she wants a ring, but these are the only ones I'll buy. Bro, you tell me these are are at all different. Give me one hard, one soft. Give me one soft. <laughs> Give me one hard. <laughs> Ew, dude, what's wrong with those? This is super dumb. Doesn't look like it's doing much. It sounds like a good idea. Why on earth? Hmm, let, me, let me think, I'm gaming. Uh, Tom, put up like a game right over here. <laughs> to help your visualization. Oh. Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, this is dumb. I don't know why you'd want that tension there. I think they're supposed to provide a slow or a resistance to push against. Yeah. Not just, meow, meow. It feels like when you're about to sneeze, but you just can't sneeze. Like it's like, oh, I'm gonna sneeze. And you're at that constant state, but you're never quite hitting the edge. Never quite getting to the rim. Make another analogy. <laughs> never quite. Uh, I mean, I would have to play the game, to be honest, because I can kind of see <laughs> the, the game. <laughs> you know, the one game we all play I on play PS5. the game. <laughs> you know, us gamers play. <laughs> That's a nope. Next product. This is interesting, but here's the thing. If this worked on the back of the PS5, better. I don't want things constantly plugged into the front of my PS5 dangling. But that's part of what I wanted to see is, will it fit flush? Will it fit clean? Will it look it's not good? not gonna fit flush. What are you well, talking about? Well, that does look a bit obtuse. Ooh, serious commercial. Bro, this product's about to change the world. Here at CalArts Institute. <laughs> Here at CalArts Institute. <laughs> Buy from me, I wanna see if it's good. Add to cart, thank you. Oh, wow! Look the extra USB, this one was mine. I was curious to see if this would be useful or not. That's right. It takes and one it USB. It makes it look so ugly. Yeah, it does look a bit thummy. <laughs> You know? <laughs> thummy. It has, a, it has a thummy look to it. Thummy. Well, at least you're not losing a USB-C port, though. I, I am, wish they had more USB-C Exactly, ports. I am a little upset. Why Why? why not USB-Cs? Yeah, I'm with you there, sister. Don't ever call me your brother. Keep calling me your sister. <laughs> I like that. Not where you thought that was going. Should we go plug it into yours and see if it works? Yeah. Sure. Whoa! Where'd Mac go? Right here. Oh, <laughs> there you are. <laughs> I'm freaking 33 years old. <laughs> All right, so this is the USB inserter. Yeah. Oh, very cute. There you go, that's that. It doesn't look as obtuse on camera as you would think. It doesn't look that bad to me. Like, I don't know why you need that many USBs. Like, yeah, because like my thing is like, if you're charging your phone and like your other devices all through your PS5, like that sounds like a recipe for disaster. That sounds like you're using your PS5 as like a charger. Just right. buy a charging brick. Yeah, <laughs> I agree. It does look all right, but I just don't see a lot of use for it. I'm gonna rate that a no. Les what do you? Le poo poo. Le poo poo. This is a weird one that I wasn't really sure the point of this. <laughs> it just covers the cameras. How do you test this to see if it works? Try to do a video chat and it doesn't work. <gasps> oh. oh. I legit thought they were like sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> this is cool. This I like. This is practical. This will change my life. I have all my stuff to a shelf to the left of me, left, and there's left. just not a lot of space. I don't have, really have a great space for that controller, and like I put all stuff there, and the controller just like hits, and then the PS5 triggers, and then my TV turns on. But if I put that underneath the shelf, 
and I logged that in where I want it. Ha ha! Ha ha! The idea here is that it just lodges your PS5 controller where it needs to be. I'll lodge your PS5 right, controller where it needs I mean, to be. <laughs> okay. Add to cart. This is one Matt's been waiting to see. It's the controller rack for your PlayStation oh, 5. Oh yeah, that's interesting. Or for your P5, not necessarily your PS5. Trust me, I have a P5. Do you want to see my P5? Do you think that's going to do any damage to the joysticks? Nah. On entry? Nah. That's cool. It's like a little holster. Does it clip? It's not, it's not difficult. Goodbye. Well, when I, when I had it, <laughs> well, it wasn't difficult to actually put in. So I could see myself putting that on the bottom shelf. Nope, I just found a key. I don't know what that is. I, I don't know where it went. I'm pulling out random things. You pulled out, <laughs> Matt just pulled out a Nike shoe with oxygen containers. <laughs> Only on dope or no. There it is, right there. Stop playing around. <laughs> I was like touching it. <laughs> <laughs> He's just like waiting and watching me get it. I, I say dope for, for those of you who refuse charging. Matt, let's act like on the table. Bro, wait, did we just literally find <gasps> the, the straw to that one? To the keycap. <laughs> Power refreshing. <gasps> Dope or nope set is magic. Bro, can you just help us all and just do some mountain climbers? <laughs> Matt, I'm your desk. Please put on your PlayStation your hands 5. In the way. <laughs> now it's good. Come on, dock it. No one can even see yeah. any of that. What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna do the mountain climber. Do it. How did I do this? <laughs> it really gets you right here, and then a little bit in the glutes. Yeah, it's that was dope. The product was good too, but the mountain climbers were definitely dope. Next product. Honestly, though, this kind of feels better. You get both. Yeah, I'll get both and test because this one feels a little easier to just put in place rather than like find out where the thumbsticks fit perfectly. I'm gonna get both of them. Good finds. Matt, we have another one here for you. You can review that one, it looks stupid. <laughs> <laughs> this is for the controller as well. So this is 3D printed, which nothing good has ever made 3D printed. That's a fact. Bro, a hat. <laughs> <laughs> this is how it would look if you were under a table. <laughs> I like the other one because you can't see it on the bottom side of a desk. Yeah. This one's more for the haphazard gamer. This is not sticky enough adhesive. Is it? Did uh... you unstick? Oh, it is. Hmm. Uh, thoughts. Why did you choose there? I'll, I'll take a picture and turn it to Tom. This is what your controller what sees you when you're gaming with your other controller. No, that's not what your controller sees. That's what you see. Let's actually get a photo no. of what your controller sees. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's this. <laughs> no, my controller. It already fell off. <laughs> the stupid adhesive. He looks like Popeye. <laughs> dude, my beard is so big, dude. <laughs> I need to trim my beard so bad. That looks like a tumbleweed. <laughs> attached to my face. <laughs> I didn't really notice it until I looked at it in that <laughs> photo. <It's> huge. <laughs> that sucks. It fell twice already, and I didn't just attach it to my skin, I attached it to the table. Don't bring adhesive to a screw job. <laughs> is that? Because you can't unscrew what's been screwed. This is a revelation. <laughs> All right, next product. An entirely different gaming system. <laughs> yes, but no, right? No. This is it, its actual own PC, but it's like a portable gaming PC. It's like a switch on steroids, and the price is on steroids too, as you can see. You can remotely connect and play your library anywhere that you have a connection. You watched me before, I did in a previous Dope or Nope episode. I actually beat a level on story mode. Of Marvel Avengers. Yeah, Marvel Avengers. <laughs> so we're gonna get the, the mini here, which we think is gonna be better for the screen real estate that it has. Let you play your PS5 almost like a Nintendo Switch in a sense. A what? Switch has like a processor that's from like a decade old phone. I mean, dude, that's why I stuck with my Game Boy Advance. Didn't go any higher than that, won't upgrade. <laughs> That's, that feels like a different personal problem. That seems like <laughs> Woods found it at a garage sale and kept it. <laughs> but I will say this also is $1,400 more. And if you have the cash, you can do it. If yeah. you don't have the cash, you can watch us do it. <laughs> Which is why you're really here, right? <laughs> Go ahead and buy it now, Matt. Go ahead and add it to the cart. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Realizing his wallet's doing like, no! <laughs> okay, so this is the One X Player Mini. No, this one is kind of like your other one, but uh, smaller. We'll see, I don't know. <laughs> that looks like a switch. I like the handles better. Let me just undress it. Woo! This is nice. I guess. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Honestly though, bad place for the volume buttons. How or often are you changing volume, volume in the middle of game park? Frequently when you're walking. You're walking and gaming? Yeah, I'm like But walk. you get mad at me for driving and watching Netflix? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> or 
your wife's like, hey, the kids are going to bed, and you're like, sick, I'm gonna turn this down. <laughs> Should we cut to you having it? Yeah, I'll just, yeah. <laughs> Because I'm sure you're going to play with this. All right, guys, so we got it right here. It's cool because it's its own, like, mini computer. So you have... It's Windows. It's Windows 11, I think. So we're going to click this PS5 because, I, if I'm not mistaken, that's the PS5 that I'm going to try and connect to right now. Yeah, it, what games do you have on it? Just some games. Oh, okay. <laughs> So yeah, what's really cool about this, since it is still a computer at heart, you can download Steam, play Steam games on it. Is it better than the Steam Deck? I don't know. Steam Decks are now being released to public, so people are getting them. No, so, it's not gonna be better than the Steam Deck. I don't think it'll be better because the Steam Deck is built for Steam. This is like the same reason why an iPhone is better than all the other phones. The software is made for the hardware and the hardware is made for the software. You just mm. can't beat products like that even if the specs are lower. You just can't, unless you're like a hardcore nerd. But like most people just don't want to do that. They just want to turn this on and play a game. I've already put like a couple hours into this just trying to get some games to run. Whereas the Steam, I haven't even had it, but I already know that games are optimized for the device. And see like right now, I'm just like literally running tons of stuff. I'm like installing all these different things just to get this thing to work. There, there you it go. Kicks yeah. on. So it kicked on. Connecting and turning on your PS5. From anywhere, by the way. Matt did this. He used the One Mini X player here on his PS5 at home. Oh, you know what I have to do? This particular app here, because I need to like map out the controls to PS5. This is the kind of stuff I'm talking about. I think the main goal of this is if you have the money and the will, you can make it work. Yes. It's not native. like the Steam Deck will be. But it still is super neat. The, the network connection here is not super great, but I usually don't have this much lag. Of course, the one time I'm filming it, this currently is not playable. Maybe if I find like a better area. No, still laggy. <laughs> Uh, oh, I'm you're downloading. downloading Grand Theft Auto, bro. What the heck, dude? Make, you know, just any game would be struggling. <laughs> oh yeah, already so much better. Oh, that's way better. Yeah, this uh. is this is instantaneous. Yeah, this is this is like high res too, bro. Yeah, the screen fidelity is really really nice. But it, it's definitely definitely playable. So this works pretty dang well as a like a remote play device, but super expensive three times as expensive as your PS5, so. It's for that that ultra gamer use. I think I think it's a dope. I yeah, think it's, it's a dope for that cool. for that person. Next product. Oh, this is what I want to test. This I kind of like. What is this? It's a battery. Oh, that's Extends cool. Extends the life of your PS5 controller. Wow. And it looks kind of clean too. That's dope. A rechargeable battery is a great idea, actually. The only issue is the PS5 controller is so easy to recharge if you get like a contact like charger that I have. But I would like it to last longer. Well, here's what's good about this is you can be recharging it while using it from a distance. So it's not about the contact charging, it's you pop this on your controller while you're using it from a distance and it's wirelessly charging it. But then I gotta worry about charging this thing. But, yeah. <laughs> Great addition. Well, <laughs> but, yeah, I'm gonna add to cart. Oh, this is one I was actually really interested in. This is the remote controller wireless battery charger. Oh, this is peanut butter. Butter nutters or whatever. Nutter butters, dude. Don't say butter weird stuff yeah. like butter. Well, nutter butters. butters are the cookies, are they not? Then why'd you call it a nutter butter? He called it a butter nutter. <laughs> butter but that nutter. sounds gross. <laughs> So this here is the wireless charger, which I was interested in. What am I charging it? No, 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 so you would charge this? I understand. Okay. No. When this is plugged in, can that charge that also? Good question. That's I would don't know. be game. That's would be game changer. So the way this works, you take this big juicer right here. This is how baby PS5s are made. Can you anger grip properly on this one? Uh, yeah, actually. It's yeah, I could play with this. Bro, how long does a PS5 controller last? Like a long eight time. hours. Yeah, for Like, bro, if you needed extra battery on this, touch grass. But I would like it to last longer. Ooh. What's touch grass? Is that, <laughs> is that an insult? <laughs> it's literally where you are when they're inside gaming. Yeah, you know how you always are touching grass? I'm talking about go outside. Okay. I just figured you were outside <laughs> a lot more. No, I am. <laughs> But you're searching for a different kind Just of grass. Think <laughs> <laughs> I'm all, I'm welcome. I welcome all grass. <laughs> Any hoosers? Any hoosers? <laughs> this is dope. I think this is a dope. Would you use this? No, absolutely not. I think I would. I mean, this is for when you're playing. Disgusting. Go outside. I would like it to last longer. I'm playing. I forgot to charge my controller last night. Just like wherever you put your controller, have the charger there. To last longer. And then you never in encounter the problem. <laughs> Puppy pees in the house. And your house explodes. It sounds like you got bigger problems than charging a controller. And then you try to play a game in a couple hours? <laughs> in a couple hours? <laughs> Alright guys, next product. You want the sick fan wood? 
No, you go ahead. You seem pretty. Read about <laughs> the fan woods. <laughs> okay, so what we've got here is we've got our uh, Nexigo PS5 uh, cooling fan with LED light yeah. for both disc and digital editor. Horizontal compatible stand. Oh, so this has a horizontal compatible stand with it. The heck does that mean? So you can make it horizontal. Um. <laughs> what? what the oh. does that mean? Oh. <laughs> I've heard a lot of these fans are kind of dumb. Not, not this one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Here's the real fact, right? Give me the tea. If your PS5 is overheating, you have it in a bad spot. They have designed these things with sheer incredible engineering to cool itself appropriately. So if it's not cooling, either you gotta turn your air conditioner down or you gotta put it in a better spot. Then you wanna turn your PS5 on, turn it around, turn the button on, then go down. <laughs> Fans come on, air cools. Hot air out and air in now. Woo, woo, efficient cooling system. Look at that toilet paper. <laughs> Dude, this guy is trash. Still slightly, he's a little bit more trashier. Hip hashier, cool cashier. <laughs> cool cool cashier. cashier. Let's add this fan to my cart before I kiss wood. That was awesome. All right, so this one, Matt. This is the cool. This is so stupid. I just got rough. <laughs> Put some truck. <laughs> this is a fan that goes on mm. the back of your PS5. Mm, is that so? I heard these things actually make it worse. <laughs> I heard some of these blow the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> Should we go see what this looks like on it? Sure. Cool, let's go do that right now. Okay, I installed the fan. This is this is the really dumb part. Every time you use it, you have to turn it on. Oh. It's plugged into USB, but if you want to run the fan, you have to turn it on. Every time I keep putting it on and off, I keep like, Catching your hand on it? Yeah. Are you noticing some airflow? I just like, I don't know, just put your pee, like the- Put your pee where? <laughs> <laughs> Cause like, I don't think this is gonna make that big of a difference. Like if your PS5 is overheating, like this isn't gonna make it not overheat. I feel like it's more peace of mind than anything. Oh, I don't want my PS5 to overheat. Would you rate it dope or no? Um, nope. <laughs> well said. <laughs> We're gonna rgb a a PS5. Are you bringing your PS5? No, I, I don't want my PS5 RGB personally. It could look cool if it's not just a rainbow. <laughs> well, guess what I got for you? Some rainbows. It's not like the average like gamer. Like They look like they like watch Blade Runner once and just like their entire <laughs> life's inspired by it. I don't like the kind of people that are like, I'm gonna RGB my braces. <laughs> Lights up yellow in the teeth you need to brush. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> This is some dank beats though, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> just get out of Coachella. <laughs> What's up, oh you're like my God. sweating? You see, I learned how to put lights on my PS5. Oh my gosh, <laughs> did you see Father Time at Coachella? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go and add this one to cart. Oh, Tanner, this is for you. RGBs. Bro, it comes with little wipes too. You leave these in the bathroom. Why is pink dry? In what world has that ever been the correlation? What's pink and dry? Flamingo. A clean. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> A clean flower. There it is. I actually like flamingo. <laughs> Cotton candy. Actually notoriously dry. Not notoriously? <laughs> True. Notoriously dry. <laughs> Infamously dry. Yeah. I can take it home and put it on if you want. Yeah, to put it on. And then you'll also get to see it in my PS5. gamer caves. All right, everybody, so we have the PS5 LEDs. Setting them up was kind of like putting on any other LED strip you've ever put on in your life before, so that's pretty nice. Only downside is like some of the adhesive. You know, you're naturally putting like adhesive next to where the fan is blowing out hot air, so. Don't know how that's gonna go. They look kind of dumb to me. It's a little too much, but I'm gonna show you guys. You guys, you guys, whatever. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. This is my PS5, everybody. I have the lights button right here. So it has like a lot of different features. Turn them on. <laughs> it just looks kind of silly, I'm not gonna lie. Got blue, which is pretty clean. So we'll probably leave it blue. You got the rainbows. So if you want that rainbow RGB vibe, take a peek. Honestly, looking at it more doesn't look that bad. It, it is a little over the top. It's pretty cool. I'm actually gonna say dope. I thought it was gonna be nope, but once I got it in the room, there's a lot going on here, but I think that's pretty clean. Shocked. Rue, come here. Rue, what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? No, oh gosh. Next product. Oh, look at that. Oh, cool. Did you just point at the product or were you pointing at something else? You guys seeing this? <laughs> I was wondering if it goes on the side and it makes it look like your PS5 is hovering. People are gonna think we green screened Woods into this episode. <laughs> <laughs> He's like not interacting with us, right? <laughs>
<laughs> for an episode, we should actually just get a plate of a bunch of random Woods things. And then if he can't make it one day, just be like, all right, Green Screen Woods is joining us today. Yeah, that would be actually kind of fire. <laughs> oh, you can light up the, the logo. That's kind of clean. That's clean. This is a must get. Let's add this uh, to the combo. You know what I always say, Woods? <laughs> Did you see that? You threw the box away. I was about to put it in the box and then you threw it. <laughs> Matt, you're gonna be hashtag pumped. What? I don't know. Oh, more RGBs, I think. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take this one home and put it on my PS5 as well. All right, guys, so I just set up this product. I'll try and make it relatively quick for you. We got the PS5 RGB logo in. It's all right. Let's take a look. This is what it's looking like right here. It's pretty one dimensional. Let me get you like a straight on look for it. Not too shabby. It doesn't come with like a remote to change the LEDs or anything, but it comes with a little button. It's like right there. If you press this, it just changes the color it flashes and it can hold constant color too, so. I'll say that turned out all right. The only problem is, is that I have that facing my PC, so it's not gonna be seen by anybody. I'm really overthinking the, the whole point of this, uh, this little light. It's, it was way too much work for the glow up, but if you do have an intentional spot for it, maybe you're one of those guys on like r slash battle stations, you got some sick, dope vibes going on. It's immaculate. You want everyone to see every single light that's ever existed inside of your room. This could be there for you. Will I probably unplug it? Yeah. That one, I'm going to say dope, depending on what kind of fella or gal you are. Rue, can I get your uh, thoughts? Oh, he is schlumped over here. All right. And your thoughts, Rue? Well, you know, I think that uh, possibly there could mm -hmm. be a way in which, uh, you know, mm -hmm. it would be a possibility that yeah. something like that could happen. Well, but, that? you know, I don't want to get too political. Well, either. Either. I mean, you didn't have to kiss me like that. You heard Rue. You heard exactly what he said. And I absolutely 100% back whatever he said, no matter what, because he said it in front of me, too. It's not added in post. I heard exactly what that was. So I endorse that. Man, that's risky. Tom, you have too much power right now. Guys, thank you for watching this episode of Dope or Nope. Turns out if you liked this episode, you're 10 times better than your other friends. Why did I say that like a bop? Your other friends? <laughs> Listen guys. Can you just assume they had other friends? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah wait, you're watching a video on PS5 accessories. <laughs> yeah, you're playing by yourself. Go ahead and click on one of those two videos. They're gonna teach you how to get friends. That's where you go get them. It's a short class, send, Five hundred dollars my PayPal, and uh, uh, DoberNotePayPal dot com. Uh, <laughs> Just a <the> website address. <laughs> DoberNotePayPal. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. Uh, game on. <laughs> oh, you ever just say something like that? On.